This is a dedicated professional in the law enforcement community. We're doing this for documentation purposes and to educate everyone out there on what this product really can do. The use of a gel is typically less cross-contamination. Today's scenario, we're going to be using Mace brand pepper gel. We're gonna have our bad guy downrange getting sprayed with it as he's actively coming after a female. We wanna get a good firm grip, lift up the safety, put our thumb underneath, press down on the red button and squeeze. Thumb in, paint the suspect with a big smile from ear to ear. From the initial spray, many people feel instantaneous effects, involuntary eye closure, nasal discharge, burning sensation of the face, tightness in the chest, coughing sometimes accompanies with it. Can you see? Nope. You think you could fight right now? Nope. The relief spray does cut down the effects of the OC. It will decrease his time needed to recover from it. As you see, we're right around the 14 minute mark. Jake's already uh, opening his eyes. He's you know, able to talk, minimal effort. Okay, so we're an hour and a half in. How are you feeling? Good? I feel pretty good. Back to almost normal. At first, I was like, okay, this isn't too bad. And then at about three seconds later, man, it hit. It just felt like my whole face was on fire. About 10 minutes in, it, I thought that this might be the last. <laughs> Let's go around. It has tremendous stopping power, in many cases near instantaneous, with no long-lasting effects. It's a great alternative in the use of force 